copper for your thoughts. Let's go, go, go. How can I help? With pleasure. Lead on. This vessel is at thy disposal. Do what thou wilt. This soul awaits thy command. Yes? Darling, I thought you'd never ask. Lead on. The place was empty. Keep those thugs away from my family. Denuvia! Get these squatters out of my house now! Arthur, sweetheart, you paid me and my boys to be caravan guards, not cattle wranglers. If you want us to get our hands dirty, it'd be our pleasure. But that'll be extra. You shouldn't have to make people feel welcome in places they don't belong. I just want to remove these unlawful interlopers from my property. I can't let them stay here. What if the little frat gets into the basement? My point exactly. Psst. They're like kobolds. You let one in and soon the place will be crawling with them. Ye gods, this guy is begging to get smacked. This man's indignant demeanor barely masks a seething anxiety. There's more to this situation than he's letting on. I'm a very magnanimous individual, but this is my home! Either they leave or I'll make them. But wouldn't you be on edge if your beautiful home had been defiled by such brazen interlopers? Guess we're all you've got then, Arthur. Want your house squeaky clean? Cough up! Uh, this is the last time I hire someone from the guild. Fine. Here's the extra. Finish the job. Come on, boys. Let's take out the trash. No, 
Nope, nope, nope. Don't you dare lay a finger on them. These squatters.
The excess of refugees outside the city walls could easily become a surplus of laborers. Careful, Minthara. As a drow exile, you could be classed as a refugee yourself. Not volunteering, I take it. I am a daughter of House Bainray. I obey no authority except my own desires. I'm busy. Mind your own. Pay me any mind now. I'm just trying to make sure everyone gets fed. I just lost a wager, thanks to you. Who are you? Someone who bet that you'd never be foolish enough to actually show your face in this city again. But here you are. And the gold in my purse is soon to take flight. There have been whispers about you, sister. About your faith, your loyalty, your company. I can't help but feel the strangest twinge of disgust as I look upon you. Is it true? Has our lady forsaken you? I know the truth. I know my parents still live. Tell me where they are, and I have no quarrel with you. I'm afraid the quarrel is unavoidable, thanks to you. Now I must report your reappearance. If you are intent on bringing matters to a head, then seek out the House of Grief in the Lower City. Though, if I was you, I'd be very tempted to just forget it all and disappear. You have some form of doing so. After all, you're about to say something awful, aren't you? In Mensa Baranzan, after a house has two sons, every subsequent male born child is slaughtered at birth, as it is useless, even for breeding. You have the aura of a third child about you. Nesta let you in. Good. Means you'll be further away from me. Teresa's caress isn't just about wetting your whistles. time I spent in the hells, right? Of course I've been scared. I kept on going, though. Knew there'd be better days on the other side. And here they are.
Don't cause any trouble, all right? It's not worth it. doing in here you notice the gnome slip a lockpick into his pocket you're not a fist go on get out or i'll i'll wake the others Eventually, I just, I needed the gold. I'm getting out of here, taking a ferry down the coast to get me home. Those bloody crooks at the docks are charging triple, though. Danger money. It's a joke. You haven't heard. An army is coming. They're saying it's unstoppable. My wife said we have to stand and fight, and... And I can't. I won't. I'm not made for this. Really? You'll just give it to me? Look. Hidden up on the roof, you'll find all the stuff I stole. You can have it. Thank you. I'll never forget this. Never. You fight harder than ever now that you have a lover to protect from harm, they sell. The Gith Yankee should encourage relations between their soldiers. <laughs> It is a proven tactic for morale. We need no boon for morale. I fight well when there is kin at my side. And now, I count one more. A few pointers, Lizelle. I heard you and your lover locked in combat, but the test you set was not vigorous enough. Tell them what happened, and we'll be home in no time. Pretend I'm a fist, and tell me what you were doing in their house. It's not like we've done anything wrong. They can't arrest us for an accident. So, I've never committed a crime in my life. That has to count for something. It has to. says you entered the house before the fire started. I ain't saying nothing to nobody until I've had my trial. I'm trying to work here. Let's rehearse this one more time. We'll tell them what happened, and we'll be home in no time. The flaming fists don't stand for trouble. So stay out of it, yeah? to 
arrest us? Calm down. This is the armory. Not a bloody open house. Fists only. Now clear off. Trade? Do I look like a shopkeeper? This equipment isn't the same. It belongs to the Flaming Fist. Gresham in my armory. Steel watches. Stupid thing will probably decapitate me for cleaning the bloody mace rack. provide you with one of those for the uh, official fee. Much appreciated. Take a look around. <laughs> 